Hello everyone, good evening, good morning, good afternoon. I greet you evening because it's already evening from my end here, so I don't know what it is in your side. If it's morning, good morning. If it's afternoon, good afternoon. For my fellow Nigerians, good evening to you Oh, I hope you guys are doing well. Happy on Sunday once again. And you are highly welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to our channel. So if today is your first time in this channel or you're just stopping by to say hi, thank you very much for coming back. I promise you saying hi and welcome to my channel, all right? So please do me a favor by clicking on the red button, subscribe and turn on the bell notification. You select all, select all, it's just free. So you always get notified whenever I upload a new video. For my return subscribers, thank you very much for coming around today. In this channel, we'll talk about the natural recipe, how to use the natural things to get solution to life without any side effect or without any harmful things. So relax and follow us along. I promise you, you are not going to regret it, all right? So in today's video, I want to talk on important recipe, yes, important video like, although I've been getting this request for a while now, so I'm waiting for the right time to to do the video which is now so uh this recipe is how to open your third eyes or how to open your spiritual eyes all right but before i go on to say more about the recipe and how to use it i want to just briefly say something on this opening of the third eye because everyone like some people when they had a word of spiritual or uh, spiritual tips and all that, they all think, oh, this is evil, oh, this is diabolic, oh, no, no, no. Let me tell you, even the life we are living is a spiritual life. So if your life or if anybody's life has been tampered spiritually, physically, the person is just a walking cause because spiritually, the person has already been controlled. A lot of people have died because of, as a result of killing them spiritually, physically, just something might touch them and they somersault and died. All right. So you all need to understand this word of spiritual. Not that when you heard about the spiritual stuff, you thought, oh, this is evil. Oh, this is diabolic. And performing a spiritual recipe does not stop your religion. It doesn't matter whatever you believe. You can be a Christian. You can be a... Uh, Pegalis, you can be a Muslim. What matters is your sincerity. What matters is your seriousness and the way you keep your hands clean. Remember, I do tell you that anytime you are performing any of this recipe and your hands are clean, that is what makes it to work so well. So I hope someone understands it. And please, this opening of the third eye, like I said, if you know you are ready to do this, go ahead and do it because. Opening your spiritual eye will also make you to see unseen. It will also make you to see beyond, beyond, beyond like. Okay, so because a lot of people, and sometimes it can happen in your dream. And this opening of your second eye or the third eye or spiritual eye, anyone, will help you to see things before they before they happen or before they manifest maybe before something happens to you you will see it either by your dream because a lot of people they do have dream but they cannot even record their dreams like they won't be able to understand or remember what they dream about and let me tell you once your dream life is tampered it's very very difficult for the person to move forward because your guardian angel or your god always talks to you in your dreams about what is about to happen what has happened or what that is already happening all right so that is why that when enemy want to deal with somebody first of all he attack the person's dream so that you won't be able to understand what you dream in order to stand firm to fight for it so now you opening your third eye like i said it will help you to show you things before they happen to keep your spirit your spirit god alive, alive. All right, to make you to understand. All right, so you need to, like sometimes you may be seeing some strange thing. Maybe you are walking on the road or maybe you are sleeping on other, or maybe sometimes you can just sit down and you can see something, maybe something that has happened, something that is about to happen or something that is already happening. But believe me, opening a spiritual eyes is just a personal decision. Sometimes it used to be a natural thing. It used to be a gift from God. All right. Yes. But normally everyone have 
a third eye because even as long as you are dreaming, you have a third eye. As far as you understand the principles of spirituality, you have a third eye because that is what helps you to in quicken. That is what helps you to uh, activate your spirit life. All right. So understand like this third eye or spiritual eye always some people that naturally have it but you that did not have it you can as well perform this recipe all right in order to uh make your spiritual life to be active so what do you need in doing this all right number one thing you need is please get me a coconut get three pieces of coconut remember in this channel we thought about the eyes of coconuts at least i've done more than two or three videos explaining the three eyes of the coconut so if you don't really if you have not watched the video you can go down to other videos to watch to understand the mystery of the three eyes of the coconut now in opening your spiritual eyes you need three pieces of coconut and another thing you need is a bottle water it can be bottle water it can be water that has a co any bowl it can be bottle water it can be a rubber that has a cover depend on the one you've been able to get all right then what do you need to do you when you get that coconut okay now if you are buying this coconut in the market like the coconut you want to use for this recipe you don't price it like when you go there and you pick the ones you want and the seller say, oh, this is 200, just give the seller 200. Like it, three, remember I say you are getting three. That is the third eyes. So now, le the three, let's assume you want three and the seller say, oh, this three is 1,000, just pay 1,000. Don't start bargaining it with the seller. But if you are the type, you can get it, just plug three is okay then what you need to do is this at night okay at night between 12 1 2 and 3 hmm? get that three coconuts that you bought remember you are opening it from the one of the eyes the three of them you are opening them one eyes one eyes and one eyes so that means you are opening the three coconuts in their one eyes all right when you open it and see the eyes, get that rubber. Let's assume you use a plastic, let's assume you use a bottle of water, or you use anything. What you need to do is that that coconut you have opened, don't pour the water like I did a video the other time. The person was like, oh, can I pour the water in a cup before I pour into the rubber because I don't want it to fall down. This one you are not putting anywhere. As you have opened it from the eyes, just turn it into the rubber or plastic you are using. Okay, before you start putting the coconut water, make sure there is water on the plastic already or the bowl you want to use. Make sure there is water. Don't just pour the coconut water before you start putting water. No, you can add water later. That is when you want to add more water. But let it be that when you are putting the coconut water, there is still water inside the can or inside the rubber. Then pour all the coconut water, the three coconut, pour their waters inside that plastic. Remember, you are doing it where, where there is night. Let me not just say where it's dark because you may ask me, oh, how do you see to put it? But let it be between this period of time that I just called now, okay? Now, after that, what do you need to do? You are putting the three coconut, then you fill the water. Make sure that anything you are using that after the, the plastic or whatever you're using is filled, okay? Now you have filled it. Let's assume, for example, you are using bottled water. Now the bottled water, you are going to fill this water before you cover it, okay? Now you cover the bottled water, you have added these three coconuts. Now what you need to do is this. After you have covered it, you are going to hold it in your hand and pray, seriously, giving authority to that. That coconut is a mystery as nothing that nobody knows how coconut generates water from the earth. You understand? The water comes from heaven, it comes from the earth that nobody gives coconut water, yet it has water. 
and is a mystery. So shall you see whatever that is about to happen to you or your family or anything that you want to pray. You just pray, pointing, using that coconut water as a mystery, as a point of contact, praying, holding that coconut, that rubber. Then after you are done praying, that starting from today, as you are starting using this thing, that you are opening your third eyes, you are opening your spiritual eye to see beyond human expectation, to see unseen, to see, just pray what you want. Then after you are done praying, okay, cover it, like you have covered it already. Go and keep it as a, as a safe place. Where you only that perform this, we only know the place or touch it. Even you that kept it, don't go there and touch it again. But what I'm just saying is that where nobody will see it again. All right? If you can put it in your wardrobe. You can put anywhere of your choice, but let it be at a safe place. Okay? Now, you leave it there. Don't touch it till after seven days. Now, after seven days, okay, what you need to do is this. Every morning, if you wake up in the morning, after praying your normal prayers, okay, without, you know, when you wake up, I don't know, if you wake up, you just pray your normal morning devotion. Another thing you will do is this, before sunrise, before the morning comes, before the uh, morning sun rises, take that plastic and go and watch your face. I mean your face. As you're watching your face, don't close your eyes, okay? Let your eyes be open. And as you're pointing it, you are praying the same prayer you prayed. That God should open your spiritual eye. That to be seeing whatever that want to happen before they happened. You know, don't close your eyes when you're watching your face. Just be praying that you want to be seen or unseen. You want to be doing all this. Then after... <coughs> Sorry. After you have prayed for that money, then what you need to do is to cover it and go and keep it back. Okay? So, after you have done for that day, cover it back, return it to where you brought it from, and at the next morning, bring it out again, use it again to watch your face the way you did at the first time. Com continue using it that way till it gets to seven days if you get to seven days don't use it again make sure you finish the water between seven days all right then after that even before the seven days you are going to be seeing what is going to be happening and for the coconut please don't eat it don't eat the coconut and don't give anybody the coconut after you have done just dispose it let nobody eat it you can put it in your bin and throw it away that one it's just that okay now after you have done doing that one you are going to be seeing what is happening sometimes when you go to the market you are going to be seeing a strange thing like you know not everybody that comes to the market that is a human and not everybody that you see that is a human but when you perform this recipe you are going to be seen unseen all right you are going to be seeing some strange things. but if you know that you don't have that power to, to carry this, please don't just do it. Always just pray that God should give you an inspiration, that God should help you, like, to help you. God can talk to anybody, everyone, in different ways. He can talk to you in dreams. Like I said, there are some people that are just born naturally with the vision gift, all right? So you performing this one is not evil and is not diabolic. You are just trying to activate your spiritual life your spiritual eye because some people are just looking but spiritually they are blind to be honest with you a lot of people like they are seeing i'm not saying that physically they are blind but spiritually they are blind because they would they are they are unable to see what they ought to see but normally god always speaks to us like before something happens to us he talks to us or before things want to happen just that most at times because we are not spiritually alert because we are not spiritually active we are not being we we are not being able to know when exactly 
our God is talking to us. So this is another way you can help to boost or to open your spiritual eye in order to see things before they happen. All right. So thank you very much, my beautiful family. I wish I shared this one with you. So remember the coconut, you are not eating it. Just dispose the coconut. All right. Thank you very much. And thank you always for always being here, always supporting me, always smiling with me. All right. Thank you. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, share, and comment. If you have any question, go ahead and say it or message me via Instagram. That is where we are just discussing our personal matter now. All right. So there, let's just see there. All right. Thank you, everyone, and stay blessed wherever you are. See you in my next video. Bye.